that's the GM80. We originally designed a lure called the Flats Rat. And when we sold Killer Lure, got out of Killer Lure and that, I wasn't really happy with that lure. The, like it, it sort of didn't turn out the way I wanted it to do. Pretty good lure, but it didn't turn out the way I wanted it to do. So this one I designed it with the features in it that I didn't have in the flat strap, e.g. bigger hooks. And it was originally designed to walk through the timber. You know, in the, you, you know them lay down timbers where the mangroves fall down and you just work the lure through there slowly, hits the timbers, stop it, let it float up, work it over the top. That's what it was originally designed to do. Um, be very successful. It's our best seller is a GM80. Um, so yeah, it comes with BMC hooks, um, 1.2 mil wires, double pin bibs. You know. Comes in two sizes, deep and shallow. This one's designed to fish through those air roots, you know, little air roots that you get growing up on the flats and all that sort of stuff. It's um, designed to fish through that, real slow, steady, and if you do it slow enough, you can walk it like a wake bait through the tail of it, just, um, and that's one of the things with barrow fishing, you gotta learn to slow down. And then this thing, this little GM60, someone said to me, can you make that smaller? So we did this one, <laughs> and it does exactly what that one does. Um, you can walk it through just about anything. There was a big trend here not long ago for um, square bills, and they used to use them because they could walk them through the timber and all that. And they tell me that these are as good, if not better, than the square bills walking through the timber. So, But really, I did it because I wanted it for the bass market and the brim market and all that sort of stuff. But the barrel blacks up here use them all the time, so. But I don't see any reason why they wouldn't work on brim and bass and, and flathead, so. Actually, there's his bigger brother. <laughs> he was made, this one was made um, for the same thing as, it, as this one, as the 80, but only in a bigger version. And this has sort of got a profile of a, a potty mullet. And uh, he carries number one, six extra strong hooks, double pin bib, all that, and he, like, it's buoyant, it floats fairly fairly well, so if you troll on it, you just hit, hit a snag and just drop the, drop the rod tip back and it'll float over it and do all that. So yeah, that's the Gutter Master range.